so we are you are going to be able to see us um, working on our place queue he is really progressing his speed and enthusiasm is so crazy he's so crazy okay so i'm gonna try to get this go find it go to your bed i literally have to kind of go to your bed I really have to kind of hold down the bed because he goes so fast it slides across the floor. Yes. So, so he's really figuring out every time he gets on here, it's super rewarding. And he offers the down. Just dropped a cookie back there. So good. So good. And we're working on longevity. Okay, go find it. Okay, go to your bed. Good, very nice. Then we're just working on getting him to stay down here longer and longer periods of time. So at night when I'm hanging out watching TV or whatever, I might sit with just some of his kibble and just keep tossing it down here. I'm, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna get the other bed out and see if we can transfer the skill from this platform that we've been practicing to a different bed, okay? Okay. Yes. Boy. Hey, go find it. Hey, go to your bed. Yes. Okay. Okay, the next step is to for me to gain some distance from the bed and see if he can still find it even though I'm moving myself further away. Let's see what happens, right? Go find it. Okay, go to your bed. Okay, so this is typical, they'll want to come towards me instead of seeking out that place. Go to your bed. Yes. So it'll take him a little bit of time to realize he's got to still hit the, hit the bed, hit that target, even though I'm further away. Go find it. Okay, go to your bed. There you go. He backed himself up a little bit. That was really nice. Go we'll find it. Okay, go to your bed. Go to your bed. Okay, that's, that's just all together too distracting. Yeah, finally we have a nice day here to work outside. So we're gonna be practicing um, our skills kind of out and about. Um, he's doing so well with his attention skills. Uh, we were at the park yesterday and. I was able to call him off of other dogs. I mean, occasionally when he gets really on a scent, it's difficult, but he's doing super well. So, so again, we're gonna practice our name game. Ready? Go find it. Gus! Yes! Good boy. Ready? Go find it. Oh, let's do this one. Go find it. Gus! Come! Very good. Good boy. Down. Down. Yes. Very good. Okay. Uh -uh. Stay. All right, so we've been saving this one for um, for after we learn down. Um, we're gonna start introducing leave it and drop it, okay? So um, I'm gonna have, come here. Down. Okay, so what we're gonna do is, this is called the It's Your Choice game. Um, what that means is that he has to figure out that in order to win the game meaning in order to learn to earn the treats you have to not try to steal them 
okay? So all I'm gonna do is closed fist in the beginning that has cookies in it, okay? He's got it really strong. He tries to paw at them, but we'll get over this. Hey, take it, leave it, take it. Leave it. Okay, so keep tempting him. Look what I got. As long as he's not taking, stealing the food, take it. He gets to take it. Take it. Take it. Okay, so anytime he puts his nose in there, I close my fist. Take it. Take it. Okay, so now we're gonna work on drop it. Drop it basically means you have it in your mouth and you need to let go of it. Okay. Drop it. Yes. Take it. Just doing a trade situation with this. Drop it. Yes. Very nice. Good job. Get it. Get it. Get it. I have to work in other behaviors while we're practicing this. Drop it. Yes. Good boy. Down. Gus, down. Yes. Good boy. Okay. Get it. Get it. Get it. Ready. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Drop it. Yes. So we want drop it to be a win-win. He gets, I say drop it. He lets go of his, his toy. He gets rewarded and then he gets the toy back. Take it. Sometimes he doesn't want to take it. He wants more. He wants more treats. He wants more treats. Get it. Go get ya. Get it. He's so strong. Drop it. Yes. Good boy. You're doing such a good job. All right. So you can see we're making some good progress. Um, we will do another video for you in a couple days and we'll see you soon. Bye.